has insanely good advantage. But the thing that I'm already assuming that we're going to be looking for from Zane, we're going to be seeing them actually be a little bit aggressive. They too, they tend to get a little bit aggressive when they know that being defensive isn't an option. They know that when their space is getting invaded, like so they can do, they want to get aggressive. They want to use can in a very pun aside, explosive ways. Um, Don't forget, can is it comes out frame one. How did that? <laughs> All right, e evening, <laughs> evening up the percent right now. But can does come out frame one, which when Tilda has those very you know tight combos, could be a really good ant. Just get off me option. Mm -hmm. And Tilda is just like throwing away these cans like they're nothing, but very nice. Gonna get a little bit of advantage going on here, rolling away, getting that fair into drag down into the up air, potentially <laughs> not just entirely yet. No, thank you, no man, no hand, no thank you. Ooh, and I, I will say that it's gonna be a beautiful thing to see just how Tilda gets past this wall of projectiles. He's not even, now we're starting to see that reflector, but for the most part instead, he was just opting to, you know, thread the needle all the way through all of the options between the clay pigeon, the gunman, and the can. There are so many things you have to look out for. Ooh! Oh, period. Oh, period. Look at them. Oh, my God. They got that dinner. They have the lead, but is that never going to kill? Not entirely just yet. Oh, my God. This is looking so good for Zane. They Ooh. are going to die to that drag down there into down to however they throw the doggy paws. <laughs> the doggy paws, <laughs> they's coming in. They, they, they are for sure. But at the same time, think about what Zane could have done if they were actually able to play to that lead. As it stands right now, despite taking the first stock, they're still getting grabbed and comboed all the way across the Smashville stage. 76%. That's the first hit we've seen Zane actually manage to land, and Toto looking oh. very comfortable right now. And you know the thing is, it's so hard to actually avoid these things that are so important to this character, how are you supposed to play in a situation where it's just entirely so scary to just avoid this one thing? Oh, and then get your can used against you. That advantage is crazy. And not only that, but normally Duck Up loves to throw out that can before up being because Wait. it does. Ah, okay, good sorry. DI and great air dodge coming out from Tilda. No, I, I, you were right to pause right there because I've seen some disgusting things from Zane when they start to uh, get that that clay pigeon train going. And there's the frame one can being able to get Zane away, uh, avoids the worst of the worst. Oh, okay. Uh, that was a little bit too early because I feel like that could have led into a kill. However, that nice up smash, taking it, you're gone, goodbye. That was that side B was definitely a, the sort of call out where he was expecting Zane mm -hmm. to throw out a gunman or any kind of, oh, oh man, I don't even have time to deconstruct what happened to the last stock because that next one is just gone too quickly. Down air to back air. One of the things about Falco is that let's think about all of the hits that can lead into a kill. All of them. The answer is all of them. Oh, all well, of his aerials I've seen just like, back air kills out right, Nair has drag down, Fair has drag down, okay. up air sometimes uh -huh. leads into like, I've definitely seen it lean into some like, back air and all that sort of thing. Down air also, like, it, it, it's, once he's in the air and he hits you at, at like past 100, it's like, oh. Uh. Mm -hmm. It is really crazy. And I definitely love the way that, you know, Zane has actually been using, you know, gunmen. And I think in that last game, actually, used it to kind of um, make sure that Tilde can't actually recover. I mean, in a lot of situations where Tilde wants to recover, they kind of threw it out there, and they also just threw it, throw it out in situations where it's just like they need to protect themselves. Now, here's a question that you might actually see the answer to as this game goes on, which is that if he puts the gunman right at the ledge and the side B connects on it, does it stop the shy B short? Um, I like it as if he was connecting does. on the shield. Like, it, it would it would um, be similar to that, but I don't think since it's um, falling down, it doesn't actually get the chance to sometimes. It'd just be if, um, you know, if they actually... <sighs> that was so good. That was really good. I will say one thing that we didn't really see from mm -hmm. Zane in that last game was the Giga Brain plays. <laughs> As opposed to right now, the way he put the way they, they put out the gunman to force the low recovery. And with that great, fantastic timing on the down air, we now have Zane with the lead. Let's see if they're actually able to do with it this time around. Oh, okay. This is, this is, be careful. Oh my God, getting a little bit of an advantage here. Backing off there because they know exactly what they need to do. And that just, that 
dropped his pants. <laughs> it why it dropped his pants. I'm so confused. <laughs> Listen, it's, it's it's what happens when you get hit? I just get I, I get hit. I don't I don't think my pants drop. Oh, it's Jesus. a defense mechanism. <laughs> it's like a, it's like how lizards drop their tails. Oh. Um, squids ink. Uh huh. Uh, gunmen drop pants. Oh. Well, pants, hat, and then whatever the, uh, the short one does. I don't know. I'm sorry. Um, oh, that was such a nice read, but not gonna get that. Gonna get that down air. Trying to use can to protect themselves. They've definitely been using that can so well, but sometimes it just gets caught out and that down air again. Y'all know how many times they've hit that down air? Three, Three times. Period. <laughs> they are in the lead right now. They are trying to wreck up some damage. I mean, with some retaliation, because, you know, until they, until they be doing some things. Yeah, the one thing is that if you're Zane, overextending can be so scary. All of this damage led to just, like, one combo that was brought a little bit too far other than it probably should have been. And, oh, I like that. Throwing out the can, but lower so that it could not be reflected that time around. But look at that Zane in the corner. That shield's so tiny. Ooh, okay. This is definitely what we could see here. We need to see an offstage situation in order for Zane to actually take this game. You know, like, they've definitely done it before. They've been getting all those timings. However, you're just going to miss that one tool that you needed and get that can used right against you. You thought you were going to hit it to them? Absolutely. Yeah, no, that was actually really clever. The way that it had been launched actually reflected it right back in Tilde's face. And that can, it will blow up both characters regardless of who it belongs to. Oh, and can might actually combo into... No, not this time around. But Zane looking for the kill, Ooh. an up smash of some kind, but now trapped at the ledge. 90%. Oh god, this is scary. Zane needs to avoid everything that's going to kill them right now. And very nice. This is definitely what we can see. Back air. Oh, oh my god. Oh, Just but they got hitting. this. Oh my god. Can? The gun from the can actually connected, not the can oh. itself. No jump off stage. But oh man, Zane giving so much respect. Oh my god, they have this. Oh, that could have ended out so horribly, but that backer is going to take it. That was so close. They had that game. They had it, and they knew they wanted it. They wanted it so bad. There were so many instances there, and I think there was that one time at that last stock where Zane took the jump. I think the gunman clipped the jump. I'm not sure. No, it was the can itself. I don't remember, but like, point is that... This could have been the big moment. No, okay, it was before that, but like, and then Zane kind of moved back to center stage and did throw the can towards the ledge, mm -hmm. but that was the sort of situation where maybe it was worth running off nairing, running off down airing, or something. He, f they finally limited uh, the recovery potential from uh, Tilde, but didn't capitalize on it all the way. And if you, if, if you leave a single inch. You think that mm -hmm. Tilda's not gonna take it? I'm gonna be completely honest. That was such an intense fight. They definitely could have. I think that it was. I think it might have been what kind of um, reverse.